You use aerospace every day. My phone knows where I am because we have launched a huge number of satellites into space and we expect them to be accessible to us. It's curious to think about what people 20 years from now will just take for granted. In the state of Georgia, aerospace is actually the number one export for the state. And it's a number two manufacturing industry. Well, there are over 200,000 jobs in the state of Georgia that are related to aerospace engineering. Whenever there is an aircraft engine working or being built, the students who are getting trained here are going to be the knowledge base for getting that done. We are in the Bentes in Combustion Lab. We are in one of the high pressure test cells. As you can see, there's, there's a pretty cool rig behind me. We have four high pressure test cells and there's quite a number of combustion experiments that are currently happening here. We work on the big commercial jet engines. We work on engines for supersonic and hypersonic vehicles. We work on rockets. The scale of Georgia Tech Aerospace is enormous. We really enjoy partnering with industry. They're getting our best students to look at their new ideas. They're getting our faculty to look at things. And we have a lot of resources and infrastructure to do research. Boom Supersonics is a relatively young aircraft company. And their mission is to make supersonic civil transport accessible. Boom is trying to re-commercialize supersonic flight. It's really cool to be a part of a project like that. It's one day anyone will be able to fly on a supersonic plane and go all over the world. And it's going to contain the new engines that Boom is designing. Georgia Tech is working with Boom to uh, develop, test, and evaluate the combustors for the, for the Symphony engine. It's incredibly rewarding to be able to work with companies that are really building the technology that people are going to use five and ten years from now. It's exciting to kind of be on the precipice of that and to think that this is going to be a major change when that happens. When I tell people what I get to do and tell them why I chose Georgia Tech, it's really because I have the ability to do experiments like this because we have this amazing facility. And being able to watch things light up and explode is pretty cool too. <laughs>